as well I, I like the ricky idea okay i've seen it yesterday but smart omega they're they're very happy to tiny again okay. flex things up it's, and... it's their stuff yeah they've done it many times not as convinced but disgustingly strong and you've also got shanks who right clicks for over a hundred already so shanks gets first blood armor, on even though like your armor is not a problem and a bit of a damage so Arena again, Spear. This is on the Bristol. They're doing a lot of damage having him face them. Rolling Thunder, he's trying to juke around and throw out some more quills, but it's just not going to be enough. He's all alone. You might be able Level 9, going into the Guardian Greaves, so it's similar to the build that we've been seeing. Avalanche toss out on a Raven with the Earth Splitter, and Tino's got a kill on a Raven. A relocate. Uh, they're going to get him as well. Yeah, and they're also gonna get this Mars. He's trying to run, slash buckle away. If Mars isn't careful, he's dead, but Sam H gets caught by the Rolling Thunder. Three stacks of the Viscous Nasal Goo on him. Tino gets the double kill as he takes out the Io. The Spear lands on the Sam H. Matt trying to chase and finish off this Mars. Jabs with the TP attempt away and gets it. They have a decent row staking lineup. Bristleback has two points in Goo. So that's um, two armor per stack. Mid Link arena. arena spear, it's all onto the Enchantress. Yes, they get the kill on a CML. Mars slept up for a second, looking for the Earth Splitter. That's coming in. Moon in trouble. Earth Splitter lands onto the Mars. Moon with a swashbuckle away. So he's out, but the Mars is it. Not a good trade once again. Though and connects from the dire. So they knew that Smart Omega was there. Blink Arena looking for the spear, trying to land something. Gets the spear, the call. There's the break. Absorb. Now they've got the break. They will get for the Bristleback. Do they have the damage for the Rocket Barrage? He's getting quite low. He's still on the run. And with the break, oh gosh, Rubik almost pushed him to the low ground. That would have been interesting. That could CML go down on the side of Omega. They get the kill Meanwhile, the top lane. And now Tino's been caught. This is all to distract them as they TP away right in front of Tino. <laughs> he gave up on the tiny. Toss Avalanche. Uh, now the oh, sleep. The sleep. Oh, homie Rocket. missile. Uh, he's going to be able to get away. Blink Dagger is ready, but they needed to address the top issue. And then Shanks just TPs right in front of Raven and DJ. And they decided to go bottom and split the map even more. Moon. Arena down, and now Moon trying to do what he can with the BKBB pop by Mac. They've got Tino getting the kill there on the Jabs, who will buy back immediately. He still has that ult to work with. BKB Mac running in, gets the kill on a DJ. No IO for 45 seconds. Raven. Trying to fight back some way, and he does get the kill on a Mac, but they've lost the Mars. They'll lose Shanks on the side of Smart Omega, and CML will join him. <laughs> Question becomes, will Roche drop Ag's Blessing or Refresher Shard if we get there? They've got the Avalanche as well as the Toss, the Land, the Sweep. They've got the Spear onto the Bristleback. Swashbuck away from Moon with BKB being popped by this Pangolier as well. Goes into the Rolling Thunder, oh, rolls Bristle up for a in. second. Raven, some shots out with Black Cannon, Earth Splitter comes through. And Mars, BKB walking back. They've got the Tether as well as the Mech. They're trying to relocate out, but Raven, is he going to survive? He buyback. No, he won't. So now, he'll probably be forced to use that buyback, which slows down the Divine Rapier. They go after this Mars, who slept up with not a lot of health left. Still can bowl on him as well as the Disruption, so they do get the save onto the Mars, the relocate from DJ. Now they will go over Raven. Satanic from ready? Up against Tino. They've broken the Tiny. The Satanic is used, but they've got the sleep. They'll get the kill on a Raven. They'll take him out for a minute and a half and they'll dive the base, take out the rest, get game one, Smart Omega with a one nothing lead over Fnatic. <laughs> mess, mess, the, mess the whole draft up just to fit the IO in. Uh, Luna. Luna. <laughs> We're not a fan of the ninth or 10th pick heroes. <laughs> I'm a bigger fan, let's say, of the Luna than I am of the Dazzle. Really? Yeah. But uh, maybe he's not. He's gonna have a bit of... Gino. Yeah. First blood there up top. CML, Sentry down right in the face of the side. That one is toss, that just is on the other side. Look at the silence, as well as the kill. No shallow grave to save himself. Mac is just he, blown up. Oh man, he used that illusion way too early, like while oh, mid lane, Enchantress. It's fine, but this tower is not. This tower is going to drop. I don't think they defend. Max. And then get a Solar Crest, because you can use Solar Crest on multiple targets. Silence. They're going to go with the arrow setup. And yeah, Yule's an arrow Eclipse even being committed to that. Not sure Eclipse was needed, but uh, they want to be sure that Dazzle dies. Without Eclipse, so. 
they just back off after losing the Death Prophet. Avalanche toss onto this Tide once again. Tiny just checking how much damage he actually deals to this Tide Hunter. And now he's in a bit of a trouble. They have a way of resetting the Ravage. There's the Ravage coming out, and that hits onto four. I believe even hitting onto all five. They get that kill on a Tino, they look over at CML, they'll take out the Enchantress. That's two heroes dead on the side of Smart Omega. It's what I wanted them to do inside the base, but they find it right in front of the tier two, so it works out really well for Fnatic. For their way. They have if not, so much I think tower damage. damage. Like this Exorcism is level two. Let's see if he decides to pop the Essence Ring, because they want to go. And there's the jump, CML. You were there, and then you were gone. You blinked. Pipe. He barely scratches through that Kraken shell. Oh god, what is ET doing? He has two points and Stomp has uh, 20 attack speed talent on level 10. Call? All right, they've caught this Tide again. The damage is finally there to blow him up. They'll go after Raven. The Eclipse is down. It's bouncing off of CML as well as Shanks. Is there an I opportunity mean, to chase? The heroes are still burstable. I, I feel like Fnatic we is call? just outplaying themselves at the moment. Caught him. Battle Hunger, Avalanche, and he leaps, he leaps again, he's into the trees, but he's not out of sight. Do they have a way to stop the TP? They do, by killing him. I like that. He was securing up Shivas, but the status resistance is really good. Havens Halberd gonna be great against Tiny, and this casual Sanj makes Rapper it a bit more back. banky. Avalanche toss coming in, Ravage, but the BKB timing from Tino! BKB pop, they've got the call, there's the false Done. promise, it doesn't matter, they've got the calling blade to dunk him down. Moon, he's gone. Battle Hunger onto the Tide Hunter, who already blew with the Ravage. They tossed the axe on top of the Tide. They got two. Go what around the here longest from of the man. wraparounds, indeed. They've got the scan. They know where they are. Like it's uh, pretty easy. So let's see who gets the jump. I, I want to see like Tiny going in, just blindly S jumping. Decent positioning to break there the smoke. There we go. But the questions are: Oh, the blinks miss, and now they're going to dive in. Spirit vessel BKB. That's Popeye Tino. They go after Sam H. They've got the silence out of three of these heroes. That's going to stop the dazzle from getting anything off. But now he pops the BKB. He's got the shallow grave on a CML who bought back in the previous engagement. They're going to move forward with the exorcism going in the BKBs out. Earth Splitter doesn't do much, and they'll catch the Elder Titan too. So Shanks is dead. Moon getting low, but Tino gone. Triple kill for Raven. They're looking over. TP out from Sam H. He's gone, but Mac here to use the BKB. The Spear Vessel's on him. Exorcism, just the ghost going through him, taking his life. And Smart Omega botch that. Just keep it the symbol. Ooh, Tino, he's far forward. They're gonna break the smoke, the loose and beam, the blink right on top of the Tiny. They've got themselves the BKBs, but do they have the damage? Tiny's kind of left by himself. And they're gonna need something here. This silence doesn't land onto the Dazzle, so they've got the Shallow Grave coming behind him as CML, but that's only damage from the Enchantress. They land the sweep, and he is low. Can he survive the BKB? They've got the Satanic, the damage is out. They get the kill on the Tino. And yeah, I don't see the damage coming in for Smart Omega. CML, he'll drop again. Sam H trying to TP with the BKB once again. He'll escape. Shanks may not be so lucky. He's got the match community thanks to that axe. Hex out. If you go on Raven, he will get saved. They go on Tide Hunter. Yeah, they look for the Tide. They're trying to get the arrow with the BKB pop. They've got the Hex for a second on a Raven. They throw him under the tier fours, but do they have the damage? They move forward with the Exorcism again. They blink on him. They've got the False Promise because they've got this Aegis on Raven. So they push these heroes back. The Ravage comes through. That lands on a three. They've got the Eclipse bouncing around. They'll get the kill on the Sam H. They'll take out Tino. And this should be the end. As only oh. a couple of buybacks into come the fountain. out. And now into the Fountain. Okay, they get the kill on a Moon, but they lose Shanks. But they call GG. Yeah, they call, they GG call anyway. it. This game should have been much cleaner for Fnatic. This game could have uh, potentially ended uh, 10, 12 minutes ago, in yeah. my opinion, where they go for. I don't know. But there's no pick that we just sent. Like. Bat Rider. They ban out the DP and puck. Templar Assassin. I morph TA is so bad for TA. Why? Because you have 40 armor on morphing. They just never oh, yeah, kill. you can't. He's out on this morph this time around. Shards will stop them from getting the bounty on Smart Omega, but this could be first blood damage coming out, and they need one more shot. He's trying to deny himself to the neutrals. Very well done. the first blood. Like, you would want to give that kill to Lance as just a good item. Oh, Raven getting caught in the Bramble Maze. Shadow Realm Strike not even needed. They've got the Breathe Fire, and they will burn Raven away. Like Dear Philosopher's Stone, Mac. Zipping in. Yeah, has the Vortex, Bramble Maze all down with the sleep, trying to get a Cursed Crown, and 
Now they go to the snowball. They'll kill off Shanks. They'll get Mac. Fnatic. They're playing really well right now. Glaives took the talent as well. Like, what, oh, what is happening? Blink forward. Damage on a CML, but they've got the sleep. Earth splitter. Okay. So. I'll, I'll, I'll hold on. Some beam, Shanks. Primal Roar. Shanks is Shanks. He's dead. They've got the snowball that lands. Oh, on the Mac. Quick fingers. The lineup right now is dealing any damage. 500 gold until Morphling finishes the Aghanim Scepter. But it's going to have to feel like a big change for them to really think they're in it with the Axe. And they already go after Sam H. He just died. Curse Crown. Ball Lightning. They've got the Vortex. They go after Jab. They'll get the kill on the Tosk. All right. Earth Splitter comes in. Moon, he loses his Aegis. So a little bit of what they were dealing with, struggling to go to the high ground in the last game at points where they were misplaying a little bit. Moon has that refraction. He'll blink away. DJ with the nature's attendance healing up. This is an S tier shard as well. The silence on the traps. The so this could be problematic, silence. yeah, against the Morphling. So he needs to be able to cover himself. Dragonite jumps in, does not get the stun off. Misses the stun, a little odd on that one. They've got the Terrorize, though. Do they have the damage? They've got the Aegis out. Tino Another turns Bramble. into the Dark Will. They've got the Bramble Maze down. Look at how many Brambles you have to navigate just to walk away. Once Dark Willow gets the shard. So we'll see if they can do anything from this. They've got the morph into the Dark Willow, but there's the Walrus Punch. Oh, three-man Vortex. Terrorize coming in with BKB being popped by Raven. They get the kill on the gems. The look over to the Eclipse is bouncing down, but Tino pops the BKB. Now they've got the Primal no shift. War and no shifts. No life, no buyback. Uh, they can go in right now. Dragonite was forced to use a buyback. Blink Dagger on cooldown. Can Storm Spirit. Usually that's not the pairing because both are mid laners, but uh, you get my point. Dragonite Tino, going in. in and does not get the Dragon Tail off and might need to use a BKB here. Bouncing BKB Primal War going for the Vortex. That's on the two. Terrorize comes in with BKBs save. and the Snowball save is there. So Mac plays himself. So does Sam H. They get the kill onto the DK as well as this Storm. And no DK for 90. Storm, again, might have his buyback forced. Your new Brambles are to hit something in the sky. More Brambles, where the Hawk at? And where the Boar's doing it. The Boar's got it. Fireball down on the DJ. Primal War with BKB B pop. They'll go after Shanks. They'll try to get the kill with the Lucid B. They'll finish him off. They'll get the kill under the Dark Willow. Now they'll look towards the rest. Omega on the run. They've lost just the Dark Willow, but is that enough to secure them? Oh, he uses that eggs. So Dark Willow needs to buy back because they want to have... Into the Shadow Realm, Lucid Beam once again, a damage strike comes out, they've got themselves the Vortex, but that's only onto the Luna with the BKB being popped by the Beastmaster, so they'll go to the Primal Roar on the Dark Willow, the Moon coming over, Moon, does he have the damage? Yes, he does, so Shanks, he's kill. gone, 76 that's... seconds, no buyback, and Sammy. That's exactly the kill that they needed to get. If Morphling can turn into Dark Willow, then this full... So I'm almost to that level 25. We'll see if it matters as much. Tier 3 goes down. Here come the Glaives. Yeah, now, nah, like, once you lose that Tier 3 tower, it just becomes just so difficult. You try to go in, roll. Tino, and now they're going to go in with Primal Another War. They've got the Walrus Punch. Can they get the kill here? Primal War. That's the second one. Vortex, but he's not able to shift. He's not able to survive. No buyback. Four seconds that, without that buyback. should be the game. Look at these Tier 4s start to get shredded by the Glaives. He invested all of his gold, you know, try to go in for a play, unfortunately, like they didn't have Dark Willow in the previous fight to contest for Rose. Storm zips in. Vortex, Fireball, Into Dragon damage ball. onto the Fireball. Luna, and he's taking some damage, but they've got a Snowball. Earth Splitter comes through, and that's gonna pop the Aegis. They have Sam H still frontlining. Jabs, though, right clicks with the tag team, uses that flicker. Lucid Beam comes out, they've got the damage to get the kill on Sam H, but he does have buyback. Vortex once again on the moon. Moon, Lotus Sword, sleep, looking for it. Terrorize lands, there's the Dragon Tail, they've got the Snowball save again! Shanks, CML, they'll both die, and now Storm, what can he do without the mana? They've taken the tier fours, they'll go for the throne. Moon sitting low, they have found their attention on the Sam H. Right Storm's gonna enough. catch everyone! They've got the zip, they have the Vortex, is it enough damage to clean up these heroes? They get the kill onto the Beastmaster as well as the TA who don't have buyback, but they still have Raven and Max He's out, out of, of mana. mana. He's done. And well, they'll get the kill. They'll go after the throne, and this should be more than enough. Nobody coming back for at least 20 seconds. And that will be Fnatic. Potentially finishing off the series. All right, Vortex All right, for the BKB. Yeah. All right, Raven. <laughs> I tried. 